Hello and welcome back to Rada. My name is Beast and today we're back with uh, Yinu no Haruka. Maybe wondering, hey Beast, you sound like got like a weird lisp I guess going on. Uh, there's a reason for that, Emily. Ah, uh, uh, tic tacs. Uh, I do have like a big one here as well. It's just that uh, there's like. A bunch of tiny travel sized ones that we have. Because my mom bought them all. Because she was gonna make like tiny Tupperware things for her weird miniature houses that she constantly makes with it. Which it has me worried because I feel like the next step is gonna be human hair dolls. And after that, it's gonna be curses, probably, so, uh, pray for my fucking well-being. Anyways, a uh, week late until the show. It's a week until the show. There's a healthy, healthy amount of tension around us as we continue to rehearse for the play. Now the next person in line, please make your offering to God. There's any issue at all when we're rehearsing. We're the same as usual so long as everyone's here. Hi, Oskare! I'm sorry about squeaking. <laughs> Attention dissipates at Hina's signal. Now that I've gotten used to it, being able to rehearse in this kind of focused way is a good thing. Wait, what? Wait, we can help too. Yes, sure. Yeah, counting on you guys. You know, Yuzuki and Bethley leave to go work. I figured out a solution for my weird list problem. I'll just put it underneath my tongue, you know. <laughs> like a certain bass did with pickles. <laughs> Good old bubble bass. Uh, leaving just Momiji and me in the classroom. Yeah. Reminds me, I always forget, I need to already put, pull the browser over to this side before I start recording in case I have to look something up. There we go. Also, completely out of fucking context, but can we just agree that uh, you should never talk to a Kingdom Hearts fan about summer vacation? Because that is just a recipe for disaster. If I don't know why, that's fine. We'll figure it out someday, possibly. He always starts acting nervous and restless as soon as the others leave. Okay, let's start with the scene on page four, this part right here. <laughs> and this is what happens when I approach her. I feel like the distance it uh, happens at is only growing by the day. No, I'm sorry too, I'll be more careful from now on. 
Our expression always turns sad when we apologize to each other like this. I pretend not to, I pretend not to notice and continue on. I think the brother's lines on page four might be a bit hard to understand. Uh, uh, And the priest's line on page 9, that might be a bit too complicated for the kids. Do you have any comments? Page 7, oh yeah, the scene before the climax. Okay, let's do that. We can talk the way we usually do when it's about the play. Sure, we can change that too. But, I think that'll be it. So, so that's it. Everyone has been practicing a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Things go back to being awkward as soon as we don't have anything play related to talk about. We've had less and less to discuss these days since we're in the final stages of rehearsal. How about we look over there for everything from the beginning, just to be sure? Uh, uh, what's going on? Whoa, hey! <laughs> she was attempting to use the strategies she learned from the Hinata, but uh, alas, it failed. But being honest, I'm glad Mizune showed up when she did. I didn't really know what I should do in response to Mumichi suddenly approaching me like that. <laughs> They're making the decorations. They're probably in the home ec room right now. So, you ここで台本直し。そ、that's okay, sir, but could you help out Hina and the others? I think they might need your help more. I think she wanted to do this with us too. She seemed like she had fun the last time. You should just ask her. <laughs> Your expression seems a little different from usual. Reminds me tried some cup noodles from the store that I found. And they were really good. Like, really fucking good. Like, I, I for some reason just have not been able to find some cup noodles that I properly like for ages. Especially, especially since a lot of them just decide, ah yes, we're going to put in these fucking carrot chunks that are too small to where you automatically chew them, but at the same time large enough to where if you just slurp up the noodles, they get stuck in your throat and it's just unpleasant. But the one that I tried today didn't really have that. It had like a bunch of, it just, all it had, had was a bunch of greens, like a bunch of herbs and stuff like that. And so it even had some Naruto in there. And it was just very good. Like, the, they, all the things in there were big enough to where you reasonably, like, chew the, on them all by just chewing the noodles regularly. The fucking carrots was always the issue. Like, you chew the noodles, but it's so likely that they just, like, somehow evade your fucking teeth. And they just go down in one fucking chunk and it is not pleasant. Call me crazy. Because you'd be right, probably. But who cares? She's definitely acting weird. I think back on how things have been lately. It isn't just me overthinking things. Mumiji's clearly acting strangely when she's talking to me. It could be that she's angry with me about something, or maybe she doesn't like talking to me anymore, but I don't think that's the case. 
Just asking her might be the best course of action, but this wouldn't be an issue in the first place if I could do that. Just can't ask her for some reason. The usual isn't possible anymore. I want to talk to Momichi about something, but I don't know what to say. And I don't even know why I want to talk to Momichi so much. I want to do something without knowing why, and... That's weird, right? It's the same when I'm sending her messages online. I don't know what I should talk about. Worry about whether I'd annoy her by suddenly sending her a message out of nowhere. This has never happened before. I've never thought things like this before. I've only started thinking this way from around Luigi's birthday. Spent lots of time together with Momichi. I have lots of memories of all the things I've done with her since we met. We really had a lot of fun. In my memories, Momichi and I are always smiling. Anyone looks at us, or looked at us, would think we must be good friends. I've gotten to see a proper smile out of her in a while. She always averts her gaze and tries to run away when we look at each other. I don't like this. I'm hesitating over this new emotion. Wonder what it means to like someone. Should I tell her? But that might mean I'd be putting my own feelings before Mumiji's. Might mean that it might mean I'd be making Mumiji ha unhappy. That stops me in my tracks. I'm pretty sure the reason why Mumiji's been acting weirdly has to do with me. Because if it weren't the cause of it, why would she act like that way only around me? Mumiji's I don't want to remember. Doubts swell inside me. Things I can't forget spread all throughout my being. What am I supposed to do? Oh, there we go. Trauma. Yay. 20th of December. Okay, let's stop here for the day. I checked the time after we've looked through everything. That was a good, ta a good time to stop. There isn't enough time left for us to start and finish something else, so let's just call it a day. Sure. Oh, but I think Mizune might said she might stop by. Momiji quickly walks out. I'm disappointed, but I'm also a little relieved. A bit conflicted. The others all look at me. Hmm? What? What are you guys looking at me for? Momiji san ni nani ka itta? No, I didn't say anything. Sore ga gain ka. Zettai so da. What are you talking about? さいきん、もみじさんおかしいじゃん。うん。練習してる時も普通だけど、休憩中や練習が終わった後はそろそろしてるよね。教室でもぼーっとしている。とりあえず、noticed too. What do you mean, nothing happened? Is it? That's true. Ask what? What am I supposed to ask and how? ダメだ。先輩は乙女心が全然分かってね。乙女心? So Bethly agrees. I think Mumiji's been acting weird lately too, and I can sort of tell that's something to do with me. I'm going to try avoid bothering her any more than I already have. Hina, come down and listen to me. I've thought this through. I'm interested in Momiji, that's the truth. I want to be closer with her. But I really don't want to cause anyone trouble or bother them. If holding myself back fixes things, then that's the best option. If that really is what it takes, then that's what I'll do. 
これは想像以上に重症だウェイねえ先輩それ絶対に間違ってるその考え方はダメだうんお兄ちゃんが我慢すればいいなんてそんなのダメだよ結局先輩が一番怖がってんじゃないもみじさんのこと考えてるみたいに言ってるけどさ全然考えてないじゃんノイアムナツクサクティワイいやいや分かってない我慢するなんて言っちゃってるのがその証拠だ先輩が我慢するのは勝手だでももみじさんの気持ちはどうすんのもうとっくに巻き込んじゃってるんだもみじさん先輩のことずーっと見てるし Who had been pretending not to notice. Ina using an even Bethly a n a l y s i s when Momiji was looking. In s h o k e n m e k a k u s t e r k e t o s a e n s h u s t e r t o k i d a t e z u t t o d a o n i c h a n no Senakaya y o k o g a o z i t t o m i t e r u n d a o s a r e d a m o e n g i o s h i p a s h i n a i n o a s u o i k e t o y u k i t a t o m o m i i f t a r i t o m o s k i a t e r w a t a s h i w a s o m o I don't know how to respond. So I did tell Momiji how I feel. But she really accepts those feelings. What if I tell her and she's bothered by my feelings? What if I make her unhappy that way? I don't have the confidence. That too, but in other ways too. Even if the confession does go well, what do I do after that? I don't know what it means to date someone. Even if I confess and she cuts my feelings, I don't know what comes after that. With what's right before me and what follows after that in mind, I just don't have the confidence to do anything. I know I'm being pathetic, but I, I'm scared because I don't. I really just don't know. I got it! That's 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 it! そうだ。うん。私、力になりたい。I would suggest not doing this at all, although you don't want to expose his trauma to his mom, who's just going to be blaming herself for it. That's just not a good idea, I think. It, it'll go horrible, is what I'm trying to say. Also, ignore me, I'm just stacking these tic tac boxes in a row, and I don't know why. I swear, just don't worry about it. Shut the fuck up. Hora, <laughs> senpai! Hayaku! Jikanga mottai nai! Yeah. The others, m e a s o n included, all gave me lots of advice. I should use words and I should be more honest about my feelings. Made me happy. The fact they all cared so much about me made me realize how fortunate I am. I think it might be okay to give it a try. It might be okay to wring out a bit of courage for both my sake and Momiji's. After all the kindness the others extended to me, I started to feel that way. ね、あの、はよ。今日も早いのね。ね、I'm <笑> No, I don't. Nina was right. I've already got Mumiji involved by hesitating and worrying like I have been. So, 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 so,
<laughs> he's gonna have his confession snatched out from under him again. December 24th. Come on. I don't have a problem, Yu-Gi-Oh. It's Christmas Eve, the day of our show. I don't blame Yuzuki for being nervous. Our audience is bigger than last time. Yuzuki, relax. What? 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 Relax. Don't relax. Oh, that's so difficult. <laughs> the other mind, nothing but excited. Contrast, Bumuji and I are racked with tension. I don't know what I should say to her. Can't really must have the nerve to speak to her because of these feelings I'm carrying inside. <laughs> お兄ちゃんと同じろさんも緊張してるよ。もう、もう本当だ。珍しい。まさか日向二人にもやる。当然。緊張なんてしてたらもったいないじゃん。いやー、何何。もみじさん、硬いよ。リラックス、リラックス
その鐘にはクリスマスの夜にだけ鳴るという不思議な言い伝えがありましたところが町の人たちは鐘の音を一度も聞いたことがありません一体どうすればあの鐘は鳴るんだろう They say the bell ring, bells ring if you make an offering to God. 贈り物か。神様が喜ぶものって何なの Those bells would have rung by now if we knew. クリスマスの前になると、町はこんな噂で持ちきりです。Jim's silent. Our lines ring out into the still air as we act out our play. Let's dim for a scene change. I'm moving. Toward backstage when I walk past Mumiji on her way to her for her appearance. Look at me. So, she's a little bit of 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 a Totally Incompetently. そんなバカなたった銀貨一枚で金が鳴るなんて Umiji's playing multiple roles for our play. She's made clear distinctions in the way she acts out of each of the parts, making sure to express all of the relevant emotions and sentiments upon stage. 本当は何を捧げたんだい銀貨の他にもあるんだろう I can tell now. I really am interested in Momiji. I like seeing her、uh, at her best up on stage. When I see her like this all the time, I see her sparkle in lots of different ways, acting out lots of different roles. Senpai! Seriu! Huh? Oh, uh. <laughs> oh no, what do I say here again? Honto no koto o yuanai to. O sama ni torae rale te shimau yo! That's right, tell the truth! Momiji saves me with a reminder, I need to focus. I need to get it together. Honto des! Boku wa, o ni chan kara azukatta ginka o, ichi mai dake kami sama ni sasage mashita! Ginka ichi mai de kane ga naru nara, dore, watashi mo! Watashi no ginka de wa nara nai, dou shite da! Kono kono sasage ta ginka wa, tokubetsu na ginka datta no ka? Kouka de a reba, yoi to yu mono de wa arimasen. Kami sama wa, 兄弟の行いを見ていたのです。心のこもった銀貨の贈り物で、教会の鐘の音は高く高く響き渡りました。私たちの贈り物は、心からのものではなかった。真心を込めて、届けないといけないんだ。God won't accept it if your feelings aren't sincere.It's not enough if your feelings aren't sincere. Bells won't ring if your feelings don't come directly from the heart. I feel the moral of the play and resounding in my own heart. My Christmas play was a huge success. We step off the stage amidst the lots of applause and cheers. でも楽しかったまたやりたいうん私もやりたいなみんなで一緒に何かをするすごくいい思い出やろう今度は水葉さんも一緒にやれるときにみんな揃ってさ We all smile at each other in satisfaction just like last time We're all feeling a little addicted to the unique sense of accomplishment that fills us now that show is over. 
Maybe she joins the circle after taking a bow uh, to the last of the applause. Seems like the usual awkwardness between us has faded thanks to our play ending without incident. Oh, yeah, you worked really hard. I think you've definitely come a long way since half a year ago. <laughs> Ian and the others left on their own after we finished cleaning up. Ina sent me a message of lime reading good luck, senpai. Just look at the message and decide not to reply from now. I'll reply re I'll reply later. To report back on how it went. I was completely calm and composed for the play. Now I'm filled with nervousness. It looks like Momiji feels the same way. Seems restless, her gaze flitting this and way and that way. Yeah, it is. But I just can't get a conversation going. And now uh, there's so much I want to talk to her about. Why can't I do this? Now yeah, it's true, let's start walking. Uh, uh. Walk side by side. We're just close enough that we could reach out and touch each other if we wanted. Uh. And since Wumichi glancing my way, I don't know what I should do either. I can't face it direct. I've got to change at this rate. It'll only cause Wumichi trouble if I keep agonizing over this. So, uh, thanks for the day. I forgot my line at the end, Red. You really saved me when, I re when you reminded me. <laughs> Still, it was my fault, so thanks. What <laughs> do I do? I can't think of anything more to talk about. Yeah, since it's Christmas Eve and all, it's all couples around us. Here, they're all happily talking about their plans after this. They're all enjoying a wonderful Christmas Eve together. Like, ah, yes, most of the people walking around seem to be couples as well. You want to be one of them? <laughs> yeah, everyone looks really happy. What? <laughs> I can't not worry about it. I've already been worrying about it for a long time now. There's no way I don't already know what she was implying by saying that. I need to say it. Touching my fist hard of my pack to reply to her. I think it'd be nice if we do look the same way. Uh, we get, also, we actually get to see l little baby Yukito this time. Since we've only, se I think we've only seen high school Yukito and adult Yukito. Now we get baby Yukito. <laughs> I don't want things to stay the way they are right now. I hope the feelings are damned up in my heart. I don't want us to not be able to talk. I want us to feel like we need to hold back. Uh. I want to talk normally with you. I want to do homework with you and FT. I want to be able to smile normally with you. More than anything, I want to watch you. I want to watch you from up close when you're up on stage. But taking that step forward, I've gone and said it. I can't turn back anymore. I think you're amazing. You're up on stage, you look like you're having so much fun. So, so, it's like you're passionate about it in a different way than we are. Anyways, you seem completely different when you're acting. That's true. becoming the role you're playing. Yeah. What do you mean? I pause, unable to understand. Would you just imply she's pretending to be herself? Yeah, 
Oh, does she also have trauma? Lovely, trauma central. The trauma center. How many top parts of it called trauma center at this point? I'm actually kind of curious. Hold on. Trauma sent me a fucking link for some reason. The fuck's that? And and that was Daisy ass. Very confused. Anyways, uh. Fuck you! Fuck you with that damn violin! Anyways, uh... Let's see, there's Trauma Center 2 Sickness Edition, there's Partners in Trauma, there's Trauma Center... Surprisingly, that's it. Funny enough, the Trauma Center 2 and Trauma Center 1 are two different game series. <laughs> the first one is Akatsuki no Goe, and the 2 the Sickness Edition is Yo Am I. Funny enough, the sickness has nothing to do with the actual fucking game. I was just sick when I recorded it. I feel the need to like talk, say that because uh, if you haven't noticed, literally fucking no one watched the goddamn you are my, <laughs> even though it won a poll. It's fucking weird. Well, now I'm wondering how much views the recent. Not that much more actually. Like there were a shit ton of views on the not the route start. Then there's like almost a thousand on part one. That always happens. Part one is always like so much more than the rest of the parts. Which is un is understandable. That's normal really. Some people do check out these games in a kind of, hey, maybe I sh should I play it myself kind of fashion. As long as you don't watch these just to experience the story. If you watch these just to experience the story, uh, don't. Sit down on your own time, experience it on your by your uh, by on your own. First off, it'll get you a bit of impression of the game. Second off, buy the game. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> like if you literally just do not have the monetary means to do it, fine. Otherwise, though, you know, you gotta support the industry and all that, unless it's manga game. The Manga Gamer did their weird licensing uh, the survey again, and I decided to rip them a new one. <laughs> like, I, I explicitly left all the, like, oh, which games would you like to see translated empty, because I don't want them to translate any of the games I want translated, because they'd be, that'd be basically the same as throwing them into the void. Anyways. Yeah, I want to hear it. Focus on Mumiji's voice. The voice. The noise and conversations around me fade away. All the hustle and bustle of Christmas becomes a faraway occurrence. Scared. Three クラスの中でちょっと浮いちゃってて。ウォップスファック。3年前、ホロロニクルマ小学校5年生の頃。私ね、クラスの中でちょっと浮いちゃってて。仲間外れっていうのかな。そんな感じ。By oh, the way, uh I already thought this after watching episode 1 of it. But after having watched episode 2 of Trigon Stampede, the people complaining about that really are just massive fucking babies. Like, if, you don't, if you're like, ah, oh, yeah, you know what, I personally don't like the redesign for Vash, that's fine. But if you say it looks like shit, clearly you need to fucking clean your glasses. 
Like, it's actually really fucking well animated. It turns out any th a CG doesn't immediately equal bad. And it's hurt people. Like, I I've seen people, like, give it shit just because, oh, it's CG. And, oh, they changed Vash's design. It's a fucking reboot. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Redesigns are normal for reboots. Like, you can not like the de redesign, but that's fine. That's your opinion. Doesn't immediately make it bad. And some people do make it sound like it is immediately bad just because, oh, it's not the design I like. Anyways, why? <laughs> いわゆるハッポービジンってやつだね。Oh, no, no way I would have been able to do something like that. Some of the kids are going to be a カンディア。I still want to shoot the person who played mm, who fucking wrote the, p the fucking violin part in the song. You build up all that tension in the music. You build it all up and then you don't let it release. The fuck are you doing? Like even the even the small amount of music theory I know tells me that you're fucking stupid. Fuck you. Anyways, hmm, peppermint, spearmint, technically not peppermint. Cold. <sighs>新しい自分になれるかもしれない。理想的な自分を作れるのかもしれないって。ここに。ほろろに引っ越してきたのが新しい私に生まれ変わるチャンスなんじゃないかって。だから私変わるために引っ越しに賛成したんだ。本音を隠して周りの人に迷惑をかけないような子を演じよう。それが新しい梨ろもみじだって決めたの。だからね。私はここに
私は結局自分のためにそうしてるからユキトくんみたいに他の人を優先してるわけじゃないよ Reasons aside, it's the same in the end. Both do things so we don't cause trouble for others. <sighs> Moiji, are you still scared of telling the truth? I was. 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 I'm scared too. But I think that's probably the same for anyone. Everyone has some part of them that's an act. I think the acting is just part of what makes us who we are. Yeah, all of it. When you're acting up on stage, when you're smiling with your friends, or when you're talking with me like you are now, it's all the real you. We all have lots of masks we wear. I guess we use those different versions of ourselves for different situations. Social theory. Also beneath the mask joke in here. <laughs> I think we all have paths of our parts of ourselves we don't want to show others. Parts we don't want seen. I think those are just other parts of yourself. That's me who doesn't there's the me who doesn't want to make anyone unhappy. There's the me who feels things can't stay the way they've always been. I think of all the things that have supported me up until now. That uh, that I think all the things that have supported me until now have come together and created who I currently am. <laughs> we could both just be different in the same way. I think we can see a lot about each other because we're similar. Might be able to overcome what we're afraid of together. Might be able to help each other through things. That's why I have to step forward. I have to stop using I don't want to make anyone unhappy as an excuse. Because I'm interested in you, Mumiji. Because I don't think I'll be able to move forward with Mumiji otherwise. No one in the world actually wants other people to hate them. I think it's normal to not want that. It's just you're a little more afraid than most people are because you already know what it feels like to have others not like you. But I don't know if that's really so bad. I think it's amazing that the reason you're so kind is because you've been hurt before. You're not. I want to be there for you, Momiji. It's okay to cry when things are hard. It's okay to ask for others for help when you need it. And I'd like it if, if I could be the person you ask for help. <sighs> Let's be more honest with ourselves. Those words are just as much as are just as much as for me as those words are just as much for me as they are for her. I need to become more honest with myself. There's still, st still something I need to tell Momiji. If you're afraid of being alone, then I'll be by your side. Try being brave. Just a little is fine. I'll take care of the rest. <sighs> I could sense her agonizing behind me. What I want to do is become her support so she can muster up her courage. Umiji, could you put your hand down? <clears throat> it's old hands. That's why I won't let go halfway through. Luigi might not have the courage to step forward yet. I grab her hand to try to get her to believe my words. And this is comforting, even just a little. Same for me. My heart's beating like crazy. But I'm holding her hand. She squeezes my hand the tiniest bit. A bit cold surrounds us. I can feel warmth against my hand. I don't really know myself what these feelings are. This might be what it means to like someone. So 
So I want to be with you so I can find an answer I'll be satisfied with. それ私も同じ。私もね。自分の気持ちがわからなくてずっと考えてたの。初めて感じたこの気持ちが何なのか。私も知りたい。Never me. I'm sure it'll cause you lots of trouble too, since I've never done this before. But with some that scary alone, I think we'll be okay together. And there are things we'll only be able to realize together too. Things that we wouldn't understand or know it is alone. I think there's lots of things like that. I want to be together with you from now on. I don't feel this way about anyone else. Just you and Mumiji. So let's find out what these feelings are together. I'm sure we'll find the answer for it together. Uh. That was cute as shit. We've taken a step forward. We've formed a new relationship that's closer than just being friends. My feelings reach will meet you properly. I don't hear the bells ringing yet, but I think it's fine for now. The snow silently falls between us, but our hands that we've placed together for the first time. The comedy behind that situation is that he said he wouldn't let go until halfway, but he probably had to let go so he could hold it properly so they can still walk while holding hands. A new school semester begins tomorrow. I haven't seen Mumuji since I told her how I felt. I've been talking a lot of, we've been talking a lot over Lime and phone calls, but it's been about a month since I last saw her in person. Never thought I'd end up this, end up this way. I'm even less sure what to do now that I've told her how I feel. And I'm not seeing her at all over break because of my uncertainty. Huh. Good evening. Good evening. Let's walk to school tomorrow together tomorrow. Dress rehearsal. Sure, I'll come pick you up. I'll be seeing Mumiji in person starting tomorrow. I think she'll be happy, but there's a part of me that just wants to run away. I'll do my best to wake up on my own. The curtain arises. Mm-hmm. Good luck. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Great work. <sighs> I can feel the distance between us, even though we just, uh, even though, even through just the text conversation. I feel like I was close with her back when we first met. I'll do something about it, but I don't know what I should do. It might not be a correct course of action. What should I do? Things are okay tomorrow. So I got distracted. That was weird. Morning! Yes, long time no see. I haven't seen Momiji's mom since we stopped by for a New Year's greeting. I haven't really been to Hololo lately because the idea of running into her felt strangely embarrassing. What? What do you ask? No, we didn't. Momiji Oh, really? I'm embarrassed, but also happy. At the same time, I can feel Momiji's mom looking at me in a knowing way. So, so, Kisa was just a little bit busy. She didn't even call Momiji. What? There's no way she'd be. She's up then. So, 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 are you sure? Did they really 
Is this really okay? She's already indoctrinating him into the family. <laughs> Mummy G, it's morning. Are you awake? Our mom looks like she isn't awake after all. Mummy G, I'm coming in. Coming in. I'm nervous. Open the door softly, feeling a little uh, different sense of trepidation from usual. Mummy G, is still asleep. I see a lump under her sheets. Mummy G, wake up. It's time to go to school. What? You're awake? <laughs> But what if you fall back asleep? I need to see your face to make sure she's actually completely awake. That's just how suspicious I am of her when it comes to waking up. Why? I don't even know if you should be worried about that at this point, given how many times I've seen her getting out of bed already. Okay, fine, I'll be waiting downstairs, okay? I can't keep a conversation going on our way to school either. The sound of snow crunching on the foot punctuates my nervousness. You're like one of those, you know those weird, like, woodpecker toys where you can put it in front of a, like a fucking glass of water, and it'll just continue to, like, peck into the water. I don't know what they're actually called. I feel like one of those right now. It's the pain of always having to do something as an ADHD dude. I was about to say ADHD child, but I don't think I get to call myself a child at 22 anymore. Even though the, the fucking law technically still has me registered as a child until I find a fucking employment. Yeah, fun fact, uh... My parents literally still get child support from me living here. Because uh, the law still technically constitutes me as the, their child in that way. Until I either stop actively looking for a job or apprenticeship, or I found a job or apprenticeship. And I do mean proper job, not part-time job. Anyways. Well, the forecast said it's gonna stay cold for a while still. Are you gonna be okay in the mornings? <laughs> Okay, that's good then. And that's the end. God, what else is there to talk about? Is there even anything? What, what is it? Favor from me. She's so restless, I can hardly believe this is the same person I've seen acting so boldly up on stage. Oh, watch out! Stick my arm out of reflex and just barely managed to catch her. I leapt forward to catch Mumuji as she fell, so I have my arms around her to support her. No, same here. My face is still hot even after I pull away. I still glance towards Momiji. Her face is just as red as mine, if not redder. This wouldn't have been a big deal before. But now, touching has become embarrassing. Yeah, you heard anywhere? I'm glad. What favor did you want to ask me? You sure? <laughs> she wanted to hold hands, probably. This just isn't working. I just get so embarrassed when I see Yukito's face. 
I was so ready to say it for sure today for sure, but then I just had to trip and fall. The time just didn't feel right after that. How am I supposed to tell him I want to go somewhere with him? Somo somo, otoko no ko ga ikitai tokoro nante wakanai yo. I'd want Yugi to have fun if we go somewhere. I don't want it to be just me having fun while Yugi does bored. Can I ask you all something? Yes, what is it? What's a place uh, where a boy would have fun? By boy, you mean senpai? The curtain rises. <laughs> I think he'd have fun anywhere. That's exactly why I'm having trouble figuring out where to go. Why are you having trouble? Because I want you to have fun too. You're so pure! The curtain rises. Stop it! That's embarrassing! How about a movie? Good idea! What kind of movie? He's a boy, so action movie, I guess. He'd probably like it that better than a romance movie, at least. I think Yukito likes SF, too. Ooh, I like SF, too. But how about a horror movie? I would hate that. I don't like scary things, either. Scary movies are dark, so you can get all over him at the scary parts and stuff. Oh, yes, son, I don't think that's the goal here. That'd be scary and embarrassing, too. I can't enjoy something like that. Planning a date is difficult. Oh, yes, yeah, difficult. It's not a date or anything! It's totally a date. The curtain rises. Maybe it's something you'll just gradually have to get used to. Good job. If you want, we can come ha too and help out. Really? What do you guys think? I don't mind. I'm fine with that too, but it's really okay. As long as it's a free day for me, I'd be very grateful. Ah, <sighs> I mean, it's, it, it certainly won't feel like a date, then. Every day is filled with worries and doubts. I wonder if you could feel the same way. How do I ask her? I have absolutely no idea what kind of place would be fun for a girl. It's embarrassing, so maybe I should use, ask Yuzuki for advice. No way, I can't ask a girl who's younger than me about where I should take a girl on a date! I know. I feel like Hina might give me good advice. She'd probably be good about stuff like this, so let's message her and... Wait, Hina's younger than me too! Let's think about who else I could ask for help. Mom's out of the question. What about Yuko? Not too awkward. What John sensei she can be a last resort. You could ask me, isn't it? But I feel like she'd just say we should go to the rink. I'd be fine with it, but Momichi is the athletic type, so she probably wouldn't enjoy that. How about Bethley? Maybe there's some amazing staple for dates that people from overseas know about. Then again, there's still Japan. I'm so pathetic. I wish I could be decisive like a man should be, but I just can't. I don't have the experience I need to for that. Or even the knowledge. I wouldn't want Momichi to not have fun. Need somewhere to go together and both have fun. I need somewhere we can go together and both have fun. I've been thinking about it for a while, but I just can't come up with anything. And this would be a date, right? I've never really considered before whether something would be a date or, or not. I wonder what Mumichi would think about it. <sighs> I wish I could be more confident about this. Twenty the thirty-first of January, not twenty thirty. It's the day after we but did skiing for gym class. Both Mumiji and Bethley are staggering under what looks like an onslaught of the late onset muscle soreness. Are you okay? Karada Itakunoi. I'm fine because I already know how to ski and I'm used to getting exercise from snow shoveling. Gym class isn't too bad for me. Not really show, sure what I can do about that. I'm 
Moomichi is bad with the cold, and she can't do with the sports either. I guess it's not surprising she doesn't like winter. あんまり好きじゃないかな。寒いし、すべてすぐ転びそうになっちゃうし。冬にもいいところはたくさんある。え、そう。お鍋が美味しいのとお布団の中が気持ちいいくらいじゃない。冬にしかできないこと。She's right, why don't you have Beth to show you just how great wind can be? You're living in Hororo now, so I think it's a good idea for you to get to know winter a little better. Oh, Bethany's ready to go. I'm interested in hearing what Bethany has to say about winter too. Yeah, especially dawn. It's when the morning sun makes the snow glitter. Bethlehem holds up her phone, showing us a beautiful photo of the morning light. Oh, that's so pretty! これ、ペスリーが撮ったの絵を描きたくて写真撮りに行った。なんかスピッチバイだ、ブッテイクだ、カンボーマウンテン。ポイズンドモーニングサンライトシャイニングダウンオンスポットレスフィールドスノーマック
I've just not been sleeping well these past few days. I don't know. And I don't know why. Umiji and I are on my on the way home after celebrating Yuzuki's birthday at the one room class. Umiji's been fidgety all day long. What is it? Of course I know. Today's Valentine's Day. It's the day when girls give 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 guys chocolates. Uh, yeah, I guess I do. So, so nanda. Sorry, nara. Hanashi wa hayai kana. To tell the truth, I've been hopeful. I nervously wait for Momiji to continue. So no. Kore, Yukito kun ni moratte hoshi na te omotte. Thank you. Except cutely wrapped package from her. Check what it is. I know it's Valentine's chocolate. No, your chocolate makes me the happiest. She looks me in the eye for a bit, and then she flushes red and goes quiet. I need to say something. Uh. Be careful! Luigi says, waves goodbye as she goes running off. Make her really happy. Watch a girl worrying over the way she occasionally trips and stumbles as she runs, and then turning to head home myself. It was such a good opportunity, but I couldn't say it. I wanted today to be the day I told him how I feel. But I just can't say it when you can just right there in front of me. I get embarrassed and scared, and then I just can't do it! I had mom help me taste test it, too. It's handmade. But all they really did was melt down other chocolates and put them in a mold, so I can't have, couldn't have made it taste bad even if I wanted to. Messed up the wrapping a bit, though. <laughs> but now it's too late. And it's not like I can say something like, I've got some, so give me the chocolate bag. I... I... I beat myself up over stuff like this who knows how many times this year. This has to be a new record for the number of times I've gotten depressed. Okay, those three. Just... Go there because it tastes like shit. <laughs> don't, want, don't like you. Uh, there we go. Well, how many times I've talked to this teddy bear by now? He must know everything about me at this point. Teddy bear only smiles. I want to just smile and talk with Yuki too. You need to hurry up and give him my answer, but how? Please let me tell you how I feel. It appears I like you, Yuki to. Still on um, myself at this point, I guess. I feel like I'm rushing myself too much and losing sight of my own feelings. Giving him to my response when I'm like this would be rude. But you get it to myself. Hi. <sighs> I think I might not be getting much sleep tonight again. It's March, but there's still a lot of snow left. Mizune graduates today. The ceremony proceeds smoothly. The farewell address from the second year is on the reply from the graduating students ring out. The entire event feels as if it were happening somewhere very far away. Mizune won't be here anymore starting tomorrow. And we will be the ones to graduate next year. We'll take flight from the nest known as middle school and each begin walking on our own paths. I wonder if I'll be together with Mumiji at that point. The 
Graduating students exchange teary and firm embraces as they will celebrate. We members of the one room class, but the upperclassmen we're looking for, Mizune. Hey, Mizune! What? Huh? We're here to say congrats. Congratulations on graduating, Mizune. Thank you. みんなで来てくれたのね。当たり前じゃん。大切な仲間の卒業なんだ。仲間。私たちみんな仲間。そうだよ。キサラギ先輩が卒業しちゃってもみんな仲間。嬉しいわ。ありがとう。how about we all have a party at Hololo sometime to celebrate? Additional negative point about, uh... Not going for certain routes. Not only will Hina not actually follow her dreams, if you don't go for Hina's route, thus far at least, from what it seems like. Mafio also won't find the motivation in the hospital because of Haru. And Haru will stay on the streets, most likely, and die if you do not go with Hinata's route. So feel bad, congratulations. I've realized this, realized this so you need to, su need to suffer as well. You know, celebrate Muse and then moving forward a step before the rest of us. I'm sure it would be really fun. あ、そうそう。ミザさんの進学先ってさ、勉強できないとむずい。そうね。簡単じゃないと思うわ。私もそれなりに勉強して努力したもの。そっか。じゃあ、私も頑張らなきゃな。ひなたちゃん、キサラ
know what's wrong. I only said what was on my mind. Senpai, this place is really bad. What do you mean? You're too sensitive. You're not good enough. Right, Momiji? I'm not going to be a bad person. I'm not going to be a bad I'll do my best. Things really are the same as usual. Mizun is about to leave, but she's still smiling here with us. Hope our group stays this way forever and ever, even after Mizun graduates. But actually get your fucking replies out of the way by that time. <laughs> it still seems pretty far away. But maybe it'll be a lot sooner than we think. It's tough trying to imagine what the future a whole year from now will be like. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking for now. So You just have to put in a lot of work for that, right? So なんだけど、演劇部もあるし、制服も可愛いし、それにその、そう、昔はかなり演劇部に力を入れてたところなの。最近はちょっと元気がないみたいなんだけど。I'd be happy if I could go to the same school as you, Momiji. More or less understand what Moonji is implying. I'll wait for her to say it directly. Yeah, let's both do our best together. <laughs> it might just be for studying. But I'm glad I'll get to spend more time with Momiji. I'll do my best so we can both move forward together in the future. May... Or may not, wait, what? Uh, we've been third years for a month now. we finally beca become used to our new costumes and classes. We've also started to really feel like we're in our last year of middle school. Did you do your homework, Momiji? Um, the midterms are coming up, so we need to start reviewing the material. Uh, but I'm just saying the truth. And she's gone. We end up in a different class from Bethley once we became 30 years. Well, that's just depressing, man! She has so much trouble getting opening up to people. She's gonna come be fucking alone in the other class, probably. Moomiji makes a re makes up a reason to go see her every day. I stop her, but stop by her classroom after school to stop to talk a lot too. At least gradually gotten used to her new class, but she still seems most at ease when she's with us. I wonder, what about Moomiji? We've become able to speak casually and smile naturally since the beginning of the year. And we are lucky we ended up in the same class again this year, so we've been exchanging lots of notes in secret during class. But when we talk face to face, there's a lot of times when an uncontrollable silence rears its head head out of nowhere. The conversation suddenly becomes awkward and distant. I get nervous whenever our hands brush against each other and become unable to look each other in the eye. I'm sure it's because she's more conscious of me, but... I still want to do something about it, but in the end I've been beating myself up over it not being able to do actually to actually do anything for a while now. Welcome back, we can try again some other time. Momiji's been especially excited for the one room class lately. 
He seems to just really enjoy spending time with the others, even if we aren't doing anything in particular. All oh, right, Hina was saying we should all go do something together again. Ah, Golden Week no toki no tsuzuki kana. Yeah, Hina seemed pretty mad about losing at the at that arcade. One room class met a lot during uh, together during Golden Week. Went to the arcade and the th movie theater together. Well, at the movie theater. We had a badminton tournament at the park, and Misa even found enough time for in her busy schedule to come play with us. Some days we just all went to Hololo together and talked all day long too. Our breaks, breaks sure passed quickly. <laughs> Yeah, we definitely should. Me, I think. We'll go somewhere with Momiji, just the two of us. That's what I think, but I can't bring myself to say it. Maybe the zoo or the aquarium. How about somewhere we could all walk, all walk around and look at stuff like that? Let's bring it up later with the others then. I'm looking forward to meeting with the others, but I'd like to do something with just Mumiji if I could. Pluck up the courage once we've both gotten a little more used to being around each other like this. And I'll ask her. May 22nd, one day away from my birthday. One room of Gakkyu, soon soon one year will be born. <laughs> so invited you all to join a whole year ago, huh? Time sure passed quickly. The fact that the time passed quickly speaks to how much fun we've been having. I look back at my memories and the scene of us awkwardly rehearsing lines with scripts in hand floats, floats to mind. Are you practicing for that play around this time a, a year ago, right? So, so. ミズハさんの優雅なアディ、面白かった。ベスネイさんも今より日本語が上手じゃなかったけど、すごく頑張ってましたよね。うん。懐かしい。それから恥ずかしい。You <笑> Maybe next year, we have to study this year. Eh? Just a little bit will be good, right? Yes, senpai! Just a little bit will be good! Right, Hina da chan Hmm? What are you two smiling at each other for? せっかくの夏だよ。好きなことをして楽しまないとつまらないじゃないか。何を言ってるんだい。今のうちに働いておかないと冬が来ちゃうだろう。どうしたらアイティングアズオンキューズ。This <笑> 次のアリのセリフは先輩がやって。全員参加がワンルームガッキーのルールだ。ほら、先輩もこっち来て。Try to remember the answer line as Hina pulls me toward them. But there won't be any food left once winter's here, you know. It's actually pretty easy to remember these lines, even though it wasn't my part. And yeah, because I was the one who wrote the script in the first place. それは大変だ。でも今は<笑> Isani 
今頑張らないと冬を越せなくなってしまうよ Sorry, Ms. Grass, Mr. Grasshopper, but let's have fun some other time. なんだいつまらないな楽しいことがたくさん待っているのにキリギリスさんは残念そうに言ってしまいましたアリさんたちは遊んでいるキリギリスさんを少し羨ましく思いながら働きますはいカット<笑>すっげえ結構覚えてるもんだ<笑>本当だね私もすぐに思い出しちゃった<笑>でしょ劇団ワンルーム学級はいつでも結成可能だねお名前がついた私たちのチームそうだよいつまでも名前がなかったら寂しいもんねゲメイルかっこいいやつ考えた方がいいそこまでは必要ないんじゃ。ひなたちゃんが欲しいなら別にいいと思うけど、その辺は自由だしね。マジかじゃあなんか考えとかなきゃ !I think back while the others are chatting. I was just for a tiny little bit. And only because we were acting. But that was the first time I felt Moichi's hand since Christmas Eve. It's only for a short moment, but feeling the warmth made me really happy. My birthday! We're having a study party at Hololo today. Badly couldn't make it because she had other plans and he n e escaped with Yuzuki and Toe. So it's just Momiji and me here studying for our midterms. What part? I look at her workbook, completely blank. I actually kind of doubt she even opened this page before today. Uh, now it's square root problem. Please don't say that you've never heard that before. <laughs> well, guess we have to start with the basics for this one. Okay, let's start with the basics. Pay attention, okay? So, the way you work with square words is you calculate the out inside and outside parts separately, which means. 答えは6ルート6うん、correct やったーなんだ、意外と簡単なんだねユリスンドゥインクラス、イエーいつの間にか意識がないんだよね That I know I was here nodding out whenever I glanced away during class We need to make up for that now, then. Okay, let's try the next problem. Hi! Yoroshiko o n e g a i s h i m a s Schoolwork becomes more fun once you understand the material. More when she looks like she's enjoying herself more now that she knows how, how to work through the problems. We have to do prime factorization for 72 for this one. So, in s u p e n k a i Okay, guess we'll start there. Let's see. First, you take 27 divided by 2 until you can't anymore. Her fingertips make contact on her notebook. Glance up, end up staring into each other's eyes. Sorry. Okay, that's good. Mom! Things seem so natural between us earlier, but now I feel distant again. We feel distant again. Too distant to make for productive studying. Eh, two, 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 Yep, that's the end. So now you can pair up the twos and threes you divide by, right? <laughs> so then you multiply two and threes since you have one pair of each. That becomes the number you put outside the radical. <laughs> That 
That's the number inside the radical. So, what do you get? Correct. That's how you solve these problems. Oh, we automatically become more casual with each other as the mood becomes more cheerful. It's fun watching Momiji get excited when she solves problems, and it's fun teaching her how to solve them. Sorry to interrupt your good mood, but that's just basic knowledge, okay? Somebody. Good job, I think we've gotten the basics down now. It's dark out, let's stop here for the day. Thanks, Mom. Mm, that's the plan. I'm going on after this anyway. It'll pretty much just be us walking home together. We can be together while we're drinking our coffee, too. Drink as slowly as we can and talk about nothing in particular as we savor the precious time we have before leaving. <sighs> August 1st. That's a jump. But a few days since summer break started. Starting here with Mumi, she has become a regular event. Glad the time I spent teaching paid off. We've been planning out these study sessions in between playing with the others over break. And we finished all of our homework today, thanks to our efforts. So it breaks all of August in Honshu, right? I'm a little jealous. Funny they talk about summer break now, when I earlier in this video I said that you don't talk to a Kingdom Hearts fan about summer vacation. <laughs> uh, man, uh, wonder if they're gonna go to the beach. <laughs> we still have over two weeks of break left. Not one week? Surprise. This might be a good chance to ask Mumiji to do something with me. Uh, actual people that have played Kingdom Hearts and are emotional are fucking crying right now. It's <laughs> 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 really funny to me that the only Kingdom Hearts games I've actually played to completion are Kingdom Hearts 1 and Dream Drop Distance. I've only started and beaten like the first world in 3. <laughs> Excuse me? Wait, you never told me that? Eh? This is literally the first time I heard of it. Maria-san when we do and my mom start chatting up a storm together, I'm left them alone some. But wait a second, am I the only one who didn't know? Well, yeah, but I have to prepare and stuff, you know. Mom, this is a surprise, it's a shock! Hey, wait! My mom's already gone back to working. Ah, fine, whatever. <laughs> you 
Yeah, I know she doesn't have any bad intentions. I'm happy to be here. I felt the same way for a long time now. I want to make special memories with just the two of us as well. But let her know I feel the same. I think back to when I decided to have courage, more uh, more courage back in Christmas last year. Back to Christmas last year and tell her. Me too. I'll make memories with you too, Momiji. <laughs> Our smiles can become a lot more natural to us uh, than they did half a year ago. My heart's still pounding, my face is still beat red. My whole body feels hot like I have a fever. I didn't finally become able to talk normally with you, Kito, as of late. My feelings have gradually changed. I want to talk more with you, Kito. I want to be with him. The more time I spend with him, the more my feelings for him grow. I know Yukito will accept me. You won't think of my feelings as bothersome. Being with Yukito is so fun that I forget about the passage of time. Yukito's kind feelings just make me so happy. About these warm feelings I have deep in my heart. I'll make a promise to Mr. Teddy Bear. I'm going to do my best tomorrow. Lovely sentiment, but you're gonna have to wait until tomorrow for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this one, and see you next time. Hopefully, I get a proper night's fucking sleep for once. I'm going to stab someone. Bye!